Yo, what's up, people? Matty D here from the Black, helping you achieve emotional, financial, and physical well-being or abundance, and your coach for helping you get over your emotional crap with your parents. So, uh, let's see here. Today's video on it's about you know how to make more money, part three. I, I guess you can say, as it could be the title, but really it's ways on what you can do to make extra money in your life. Um, there's, it's funny when people ask this question because I used to have, I used to have, I used to think about this too. There are a shit ton of ways to make extra money on side outside of your job a shit ton both legal and, and illegal and if you're not if you're if you're someone who doesn't want to risk going to jail i suggest you stick i suggest you stick to like legal ways i mean you could do start a business from home join a network marketing company yes those are legal they've been around for years amway's the first one um they've been around for since the 50s and they're like they're a billion dollar company okay there's investing in real estate. There's stuff you can do stock market, day trading. There's uh, learn SEO. There's so many different ways, so many different ways. And people want to know what's the best way to make extra money. And that's not the right question you want to ask yourself. There's tons of ways to make to make money, lots of money. The questions that you want to ask is, is you know, is this going to be fun? Is it going to serve me? Will serve the planet? You really want to go deep in this. You want to get past the whole money part, which is hard to do. Granted, if you're a person who's in a situation where in a situation where you need money like now, I get that. And you need to, you need to learn to relax and just breathe and relax because here's the thing. If you need to make money, do what you got to do, but make sure it's a temporary thing where you can do something that you want to enjoy. Because here's the thing. A lot of people don't like their jobs, but yet they stay there. Why? Because they have to. They can't go anywhere else. They they don't like... They feel like they feel like they have no options. Like they want something. They want to, they want to do something that that they enjoy. So, advice in the video is this: is is that look? If you want to make extra money outside, make money that you want to that you want to, that you want to make in a way that's good for you. I just gave the answer away. Do something that you like to do, that you enjoy. Because if you don't, what's going to happen is you're going to treat you're going to treat it just like your job, and do just enough where it may be successful for you, it won't not, or will not. Because if you think about it, a lot of people at their job, they do just enough, just enough so that so that they don't get fired. And why? Because they don't like what they do. So think of some things that you would enjoy doing. Do some research. Go on to Google. Google ways to make money from home or ways to make money from that are fun. Type something in. Start doing some research and find something that resonates with you. If it resonates with you, go for it. Fucking do it. If it's stock market, do stocks. If it's day trading, do day trading. If it's basket weaving, do basket weaving. I don't give a fuck what it is. You got to do what's good for you, what you, what feels good for you. Because if you end up doing something that, yeah, you could do something that, makes, that, make, that can make a lot of money. But if you fucking hate it, that comes at the cost of your happiness and your health. I'm telling you, if you do something you don't like doing, it has a negative impact on your body. And it, and it can make you sick. Literally, it can like, you don't believe me? Why do you think a lot of people on Sunday nights get to, get depressed? It's true. It's a true, true st uh, statistic. I'll put a link in here. Um, it's like a lot of people get depressed on Sunday nights because they had to go back to work on Monday. And, and another surprising statistic is that the vast majority of heart attacks happen on Monday. Why is that? Well, because people don't like going to work on Monday they hate or hates Monday because the first of the week and it sucks. It's like, oh, Monday sucks. It's like, no, this is what I mean. When you hate something enough and you're doing it for so long, it takes a physical toll on your body. You get depressed and you get a heart attack. Now, obviously, f food you eat plays a major role. But the fact that what compounds even more is the feelings, it's the, it's the negative feelings you have about your job and the day of the week that cause that will cause your body to go, man, nah, fuck it. We're giving out happens it's true so choose something that you like that you want to do choose something that you want to do you like okay i'm telling you you from my own experience i've done things that that i that i got into just for the money and then i realized i didn't want to i didn't want to do it i'm like this is bullshit i wasn't because the thing is you'll do it for the money and then you'll then at some point you'll stop and you're wondering why you're not working so hard, why you're not seeing results, getting results that you want, why you're not, you know, what's going on. It's because you're doing something you don't enjoy doing and you're going to stop. You would naturally do this. And here's the thing. 
if people had a choice with their job or they could stop going to work, a lot of people would. They'd be like, fuck this, I'm not doing this shit anymore because we're humans. Humans like to have fun. We want to do things that are that, that are meaningful and fulfilling to us. And like nobody in this planet, even even the, even the older generation that that all work hard, that, that you know, even them where they're like, you know, they'll work hard regardless because that's how they were raised and what they're taught. Even they didn't grow up coming to this world to do some shit that they didn't enjoy just so they could survive, just so they could get rich. Nobody wants to do that. And if they fucking tell you, well, that's just how it is, bullshit, they don't lie. I don't know what I'm talking about. Like, nobody wants to do that. So, hope so. Helps. Like this video. Being black. Peace.